Y'all enjoying yourself tonight? Yeah, Y'all loving these brothers I brought up for you? I can see y'all in the back, I know. <laughs> Ain't nothing but cheese and smiles in it. Let's keep this soul pain, this soul, soul poetry train going, shall we? Yeah. <laughs> I think we're addicted to our love. Like, like we go through withdrawals when we're not snatching off each other's draws or get that itch like a heroin addict that's waiting for that next fix. See, I know. I want to snort you like Colombian coke just to feel your love numb my esophagus tingling my throat. Roll you like the best Afghan, Indian, California, booyah weed just to keep that high out of body experience with you not next to me. Sip the tip of my Ciroc mix and pretend it's both set to your wet lips. See? I like to watch you butt naked, poorly singing, we gon' be all right, oh. Beyonce and Jay-Z love it, got nothing on us. For even when I'm sober, zoning out on your intoxicating scents, I become inebriated, contemplating if I should jump in my ride in fear of catching a DUI or a ticket for speeding like I'm on speed just to come by and come between them sexy thighs. How dare you trip on this type of ad? We just strung out like a meth head breaking bad the same way you get sprung when he's licking the pro tongue. I know. First is denial. Do you up late up night tweaking, waiting for that next hit? Can't go on with your life without that call or text from your drug dealer, my bad, your lover. So an anxiety kicks in, you have to pop a Xanax just to calm down your temperament. For even when we full and fulfilled, we still, still want more of that last thrill. Can't trip on that type of addict if you ain't never had it. That dopamine exploding in your cells, endorphins busting through your bloodstream, making her moan, scream, and cream in ways she could never believe. Molly, Percocet, nor codeine can compare to wet and soaked sheets caused by Cupid's love, arrow, aka syringe, because once pricked, oh, you can never go back to that artificial, watered down love shit they brag about. For even that rose little buddy you got on your nightstand can't compare it to a man that can stand up in it. Let me say it again. <laughs> Even that rose, a little buddy, you got in your nightstand battery can't withstand a man that can stand up in it. Can I get an amen? Church. Blue pill or red pill? Morpheus said we have a choice. Do we check ourselves into rehab and awake from this dream of hallucinogenic vibes we have for one another? Alice, beautiful wonderland on LSD, fantasy in disguise, or do we continue to partake of this love drug that keeps our body at peace and our mind at ease? There's a cost of both. One is complete, utter misery. While the other, <laughs> the other is freak nasty, draped in ecstasy. I think we have an addiction to our love. For I want to taste you like a sugar cane Delta 8 edible. Have your body intertwined with mine as head bangs against headboard. For my mission is not missionary, but to flip you in different positions as we stare into each other's optics. Heart pours out words of gratification like your favorite or brown and clear liquor. The feeling of euphoria, pleasure, natural chemistry delivers. See, I judge not those addicted to their love drug. But like any vice, the body wants more. So you have to take it in micro doses. Try not to overdose on it. For the moment you get it again, and again, and again, <laughs> it feels, Lord, it feels 10 times magnificent. Are you addicted to your love drug? Yeah. <laughs> so y'all know, y'all jump in your car, y'all hear that, we gonna be all right. You're welcome. <laughs> y'all ready to keep going? Yeah. All right. I am soul power. 1974 Zaire, rumble in the jungle, titled and labeled as an animal. My color makes men fear what they do not know, plus I chant I am black and I am proud, and it shows, enchanted with blackness. From the top of this earth to the bottom of this axis, that's 30 seconds from topping off with 30 dudes all draped in blue with a zoo sweaters on, token in our essence for our protection. We kept them second guessing because they pulled out those Smith and Wessons and hung out us in his adolescence with no hesitation. Those gorillas transforming the educated apes who bust out of your mistake only to create a new era of blue rag holders and West Coast bangers. Red rag toters and West Coast bombers that'll pop you at a drop of a dime. 
That's when I realized I was soul power. And would devour these snakes that raped and consumed our mother's wombs and just for kicks, made each other, hate each other's dark and light skinned colors, even though we are blood brothers coming from the same mothers, wore the same cloth, walked the same soul, embraced the same yellow sun, hugged them same sons, now we spit them guns back at you. The king in me cannot rest, for I've seen bullets rain down like hailstorms. It's July 4th every day on my turf, but them firecrackers screaming at the former independence. The king in me is enraged. The cage lion is ready to break free. So how can they say that crime does not pay for every country carries AKs? And if this is the last of days, I'm going to activate my soul power. I'm going to grab my pen, put on my headphones, open a notebook full of blank holographics, close my eyes and dig deep into my DNA, meditating on the words of those before, collecting all the heavenly sick black dialect that makes my bald head poof and turn to an afro. My jeans become bell bottoms, my t-shirts now are dashiki, and my speech is black unity and equality. Sitting in a round table with Huey Newton, Geronimo Pat, Marcus Garvey, Nat Turner, Malcolm X, Martin Luther King, Muhammad Ali, Barton Ali, Nelson Mandela, Rosa Parks, Aretha Franklin, Nina Simone, damn my man Pac. Hey, I am so Pac. I am so power. I am so power 1970s, baby. My roots cannot be uprooted. It goes without saying. Too many of us have died for me to forget. So I won't let it die. I will continually water our family tree, keeping our history fresh as a pair of new kicks. Without those who paved the way, will we be here today? Some taught us to use force. Others say, educate yourself and you have a voice. I say, let us do both. Let us not forget. Let's pump this fist high like it's 1969. Instead of letting off shots at each other, let's throw block parties and fish fries, backyard boogies, laughing and giggling while fine sisters dance and gyrate. Old school slapping dominoes and spades and the mugs are sitting in the shade of the family tree because we're still alive. We're not all locked up, strung out, and singing freedom rhymes. Eternal reflection is at your grasp. This isn't power to the people for which I stand. This, this is the power that is in me. This is how I stand. So if you're like, here we go again. Another brother talking about the past for I'm doing good and I'm successful. I, I, I. I, I, I. I want to reach you, you proudful, selfish, arrogant fool, you, for this is not activism. This is reactivation. Blood born without the sickle cell trait preservation. Education determines your faith. So tell me, can y'all feel your soul power? I say, can you feel your soul power? Well, if so, scream yes. Stand up and confess. Jump about your seat. Say, I am black and I am proud. Throw your voices to the heavens. Shoot it past the clouds. Let it all hang out. For our Redeemer is close at hand. And when he comes, two fists I will command. Shooting it proudly with a passionate allure. Screaming, I am soul power. I am soul power. I am soul power. You are all soul power. 1974 Zaire. Black Bomb. Thank y'all. Yeah.